I'm a clinical nurse educator for urology and gynaecology. Welcome to our catheter education video. This is created by the staff on the urology ward at St Vincent's Private Hospital to make this time a bit easier for you. We are going to discuss caring for your catheter so that you will feel comfortable and confident to take care of your catheter while at home. After watching this video, your nurse will answer any questions which you may have. Your nurse will fit your catheter onto a leg bag as shown later in the video. Please feel free to ask the nursing staff any questions you have. We are here to help you recover in the best way possible. You may have had surgery that requires you to have a catheter in for a period of days dependent on your surgeon. Caring for your catheter right now may feel daunting. However, after watching this video and discussing concerns with your nurse, we hope you will feel empowered and ready to face going home with a catheter with confidence. This is known as a leg bag. It can hold up to 500 mils of urine. It is recommended that you empty the bag when it is about two thirds full. Monitor this bag throughout the day as it fills up depending on your hydration levels. Your catheter will need to be worn on the leg which is closest to the side of the bed that you sleep on. The reason for this is when we connect the night bag onto your leg, it will need to be below waist level to drain. Therefore, best to be left on the floor overnight as shown in the video. Prior to touching your catheter, always perform hand hygiene. Washing your hands is the best way to help reduce the risk of introducing bacteria, which may lead to a urinary tract infection. The nursing staff use gloves due to the potential exposure to bodily fluids. However, you do not need to wear gloves. A brand new leg bag needs to be shut before attaching to the catheter. To attach to the catheter, carefully remove the gray tip on the top of the catheter. Be careful and try your best not to touch the top of the new catheter below the gray cover, as this part will be connected into your catheter and we aim to keep it as clean as possible. Gently disconnect the catheter bag currently attached, then attach your new leg bag as shown. We want you to feel comfortable in changing the catheter bag in the small chance there are any problems with the catheter. However, ideally this leg bag you have attached today should stay on until you have your follow-up appointment. Secure the catheter bag onto your leg there will be two Velcro straps. The biggest strap should be worn above the knee as shown. Passing the buttons through the holes as shown to help secure the catheter to your leg. Well done, you have successfully connected your new leg bag. This is known as a catheter fixation device. There are different types available. It helps to anchor your catheter to your leg, making it more comfortable for you. To empty the catheter, it is usually found easiest to undo the bottom Velcro strap, hold the catheter over the toilet and empty into the toilet as shown. If you have any back problems, sit down on the toilet and empty your catheter into a container, such as an old milk carton or bottle, to take the pressure off bending over and allow you to remain steady when emptying the bag. This bag will be used overnight, so you do not have to get up to empty your leg bag during the night. The bag can hold two liters of urine. To use this bag, again, start by performing hand hygiene. Then remove the blue tip from the top of the catheter and place in container as shown. 
connect the night bag to the bottom of the leg bag. Remember, you never remove the leg bag unless you have been instructed to. Open the tap of the leg bag so that the urine can drain freely into the night bag. Leave the bag on the floor overnight. In the morning, the night bag can be disconnected. Close the tap on the leg bag prior to disconnecting the night bag. Disconnect the bag and then empty the urine into the toilet. Once empty, rinse the night bag with warm water. Reapply blue cap to the night bag and empty remaining contents into the toilet. You will be given a show bag on discharge containing equipment required to take care of your catheter at home. Your nurse may show you our urine colour scale card, also known as the UCS card, which you can take home with you also if required. This is used to distinguish the colour of urine. If your urine colour is a 1 to 3 or 6 to 8, it is advised to increase your water intake. There may be some blood in the urine depending on the surgery you have had. Seek medical attention if required. We hope you enjoyed our video and feel more comfortable and confident in taking care of your catheter. Please ask the nursing staff if you have any questions.